Have you ever wondered how clean your room really is? We're gonna show you how to do that in this video. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Lane Fornerat, AKA Lane Vids, and this channel is all about building stronger family bonds together as a family through travel and fun videos, and I do product reviews as well. And today's video is something that I got from our library, which is kind of interesting because it's not a book or a movie or a video game. It's this thing. So we got this little guy from the library. It's called the Spec Air Quality Monitor. Uh, I'll link it up down below if you guys want to check it out. But basically, you plug it in and it gives you a number of particles in the air. I don't know the exact like math or whatever behind what the number actually means, but it's a certain amount of particles in the air. And so what you, what you do is you can plug it in, comes with a little plug, or you can plug it directly into your computer. So it turns on starting with zero and then it has a little fan on the side here. I guess it's like an intake for it and it uh, measures how much dust particles are in the air. And so with this, you know how clean your, that particular spot of your room is. So what we did is we took this, we set it in a room, we left it there overnight uh, to kind of let it get a good reading, and then we'd get up, and then we decided that we wanted to clean our house. So we put it in one particular room, and we just started cleaning and cleaning and cleaning. Of course, the more you clean, the more dust is gonna uh, fill the air, so the higher the reading is gonna be on here. So once you uh, are done cleaning, we let it sit again. We actually left it on overnight, and then we, uh, you can look back on it and, and see what the dust particles was the next day and uh, to see what kind of readings you're getting. Worked really great because it's kind of like a game for me, you know? We'll be dusting and cleaning and whatever and we'll see the number get like really high. I think you know, the highest we saw was like 11,000, which is really high. And so it makes you want to take that extra effort to try and get that number down as you're cleaning. So I kind of gamified it for myself to make it fun. Now it does connect to Wi-Fi if you want to monitor it on your computer. Uh, it also, if you plug in the USB cord to your computer, you can download a spreadsheet. I think it's a, it takes a reading every 30 seconds or every minute. You can kind of set the interval. Uh, and it's just a great way to kind of see uh, what the air quality in your house is like. And I think it's good just because whenever we did it in the living room, it was at, it, just leaving it there was at like 1200. And then we did some other rooms and then we came back, we started cleaning that room, it got up to like 3000. And then, but once we got it all cleaned and everything else settled, it stayed at like 500, I think. So we did, we, we did a really good uh, particle cleaning there. Whenever we started doing this, uh, you know, we were cleaning the house, we were kind of doing a lot, doing like a deep clean. And the kids got really excited about cleaning too. So they were like helping us clean. So it made it like a family affair, which was super fun. Uh, so if you want to, it's a kind of a good way to motivate your kids to clean because we'd be like, oh, it's getting kind of high. We need to clean some more. And they'd be like, okay, let's see if we can get it down. So it's just a fun little thing, like I said, to gamify it with. So, so one thing that this is great for is if you have allergies, allergens, asthma, uh, I, just any kind of respiratory thing, obviously there's not as much dust in the air. So it would hopefully make you feel better, you know, you're, you have a cleaner, cleaner air that you can breathe. So um, definitely would recommend one of these if you have something like that. What I found interesting is that the bedrooms were a lot more dirtier than some of the other rooms in the house. And then I realized is whenever I started shaking the blankets. So I'd shake the blankets and of course the blankets contain more dust in them and then I'd see the reading go up, I'd go and I'd wash all a bunch of blankets and then I'd come to put them back and whenever I sh shook the blankets, this reading uh, didn't change very much, not as high as it got. So uh, note to self to wash your blankets and sheets. <laughs> But uh, I just wanted to share that with you guys. That's what we did for like three days out of our Thanksgiving break is we um, we went and cleaned a whole bunch of our rooms. So if you're into that, again, I'll put a link down in the description below on Amazon. You may want to check with your library. Like I said, that's where I got mine. They are, have a program right now where they are letting uh, you rent these for a week. So. Uh, rent them, I guess check them out is a better word because you don't have to pay anything at the library. So if you guys want to check some of that out, um, I'll leave a link to Amazon down in the description below. I think I found it on there. Very cool device. Highly recommend it. If you guys want more videos from us, make sure to click that subscribe button. Like I said, we're all about having fun as a family so that we can build stronger family bonds together. Um, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for being... <laughs>
<laughs> They're in the other room. 